Gosh, I'm very excited. I can't believe we get to do this and, you know, people have showed up and are enthusiastic and that brings me excitement because um, I was nervous. So, yeah, I'm thrilled. And it was really lovely because you went to the fans first. Yes. And I noticed that. I was like, she was like, shove the press. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, going to yeah. go to the fans. What was yeah, yeah. that like? Yeah, I just, I couldn't wait to, like, feel their energy. I needed it. So, um, yeah, they're so much part of this show. They made it. Um, you know, it was he had a huge fan base before, and so we do it for them. So it's, it was nice to meet them. This is a life-changing role for you. Now, I did not know when we watched season one, you guys were already sh shooting season two. So yeah, so it was almost like you had no idea it was going to be this huge, huge success. So now, knowing what it's become, does it feel a little bit more nerve-wracking? No, actually, I feel less pressure. I feel more confident because COVID. I mean, everything that's happened in the past two years, you just you gain perspective on things and this is an entertaining show and I hope it entertains people. And Yennefer is such a fun character with so many layers. She has such a transformation in season one. Season two, I'm thinking about what happened at the end. I know it's cold. It's cold. It is cold. <laughs> um, is she locked up? I know you're not going to tell me anything. Um, is, is she going to be rescued or will she rescue herself because she isn't a she damsel in distress? She always rescue herself and I think that's the message of this season for Yennefer is like, when everything is taken from you, you've got yourself. Do you think the subject matters are like really relevant with a lot of the stuff that we're talking Absolutely. about right now? I mean, I think it would, you have to, every series, everything that we do today needs to be progressive and develop, you know, and relate to our world because, um, yeah, why wouldn't you? I mean, that's how you relate to shows. And I really am glad with this fantasy show that we're able to kind of connect to the humanity of these characters. And the love affair, the romance. Um, we love romance. You got us through lockdown because we were loving it. And will there be any more bath scenes? And will there be some loving? Oh, um, oh, I can't tell you. Um, <laughs> I mean, there's always there's always going to be that connection between her and Geralt, and you know that will follow through the whole journey. So nice to talk to you. Stay warm. Take care.